So whether you buy a Heartland RV Cyclone toy hauler new, or some of you may have bought a used Cyclone, it may have this Yeti upgraded option. So I wanna talk about what this switch is and what it does. This switch is a heat pad that goes on your holding tanks. Now, to activate it, you would just turn the switch on and then the Yeti package switch would be glowing red. We point out explicitly in our manuals that it is important that your holding tanks have water in them. You never wanna run the heating pad on the holding tanks when they are empty because they can cause damage. So do not turn the Yeti switch on when the holding tanks are empty. Ever. Sorry for being aggressive, but I got excited. But it is really important because, you know, buying an RV is a big investment. So I really want to make sure when I work with John and Corey from our team that we keep pointing out what is really, really important for all RV owners to do in terms of following the precautions that we outline in the manuals. Um, one other thing, does it matter uh, the time of day? No, time of day is not going to impact when you use uh, the Yeti switch, again, what's really the only thing that you gotta make sure is that those holding tanks are not empty. All right, everybody, so I'm under the third axle. This is the black water tank. Thank God there's no leaks here. Um, but when I talked about that uh, Yeti upgrade, this is what the heat pad will look like when you turn on that Yeti switch. It's right here. And again, it is imperative it doesn't matter day or night when you turn this on, but you have to have fluids in the holding tank or you risk damaging these tanks.